Hey, what's up, y'all? I got the thought of the morning. Just wanted to bring it to y'all. Man, you know, I'm trying to help everybody communicate in the world. You know, so. Um, this is probably something people want to say, but a lot of people haven't said it. Um, grandparents and parents, I know we know you like supporting your kids and doing what the best thing what you feel is the best thing, but for everybody's sake, and I'm gonna speak it out, and I'm, I'm sure I'm probably talking for a lot of people, and they don't might not want to tell you, but you gotta stop. You gotta you gotta stop inviting people to your kids' sports when your kid don't get in the game. Okay, I said it. I said it. I mean, you know, a lot of people want to say it, you know, you're taking from people's Saturdays. And, you know, people just get tired of just waving at him in the bench, you know, supporting and stuff like that. If you know he's not getting in the game, stop telling people to come to the game, you know. And then we got to just wonder when they're going to put 32 in. You know, it's not fair to us. It's not fair to other people, you know what I'm saying. You could be doing stuff. You know, people want to support, but... If he ain't even getting in the game, you ain't you ain't gotta tell up. See, the formula should be like this. If it take longer to get to the game, <laughs> your, your kid plays in the game. <laughs> hey, <laughs> if it. <laughs> If the time, if the time it takes to get to the game divided by two is greater than the time your kid is in the game, then you could just video it and show people them in the game. You don't, you don't have to tell a lot of people to come to the game if this formula doesn't add up. So remember, just remember this formula. The time it takes to get to the game, the drive, divided by two. If it's greater than the time the kid plays in the game, you might stop inviting people out there. Now, if it's a close friend or relatives, you can divide it by three. That way, if the time it takes for you to get to the game, divided by three, is greater than the time he's going to be in the game, <laughs> and you divide it by three, then <laughs> you, you don't need to go to the game. So, I mean, <laughs> put him in boxing. He'll start all the time. He, he'll, I guarantee you, if he's playing, he's starting. He gets to play the full time. <laughs> Man, I divide it by three and everything. Also, if, 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 you know, the response you get from mutual friends, like if you like, hey, did you go to Rick's son game? And the response you get is like, man, yeah. Or something like that. <laughs> I mean, everybody plays a role. Everybody plays a role <laughs> for the team, you know. But fans, fans don't have to play that role. You know what I'm saying? We don't have to really play that role. You know what I'm saying? And then, you know, it's a long ride home and, you know, you wondering what's going on and <clears throat> it gets real complicated. It can get really complicated in relationship. Another, another bad response would be, <laughs> hey man, did you go to little Kevin's game, man? Man, what? If that's if that's the response you get, man, what, man, what, or like that? It depends on the tone. If it's like, man, what, do you miss something? If it's like, man, what, it's, it's different. That's that's two different man what's. You know what I'm saying? And they have two different meanings. Hey, hey man, did you did you go to little Kevin's game? Man, what? You know that's that's a good thing. But hey, man, did you go to little Kevin's game? Man, what? Two different, same words, two different meanings. You just got to pick it up. Also, here's, here's something else that's real important, too. If, if you're going to blame the fact that, 
that your grandson or son or whatever didn't get in the game because of the coach. Like, you know, the coach don't, man, coach be driven, blah, blah, blah. Make sure he doesn't get in the game. That it doesn't really work if the people actually see your kid play and then you start blaming on the coach. You got to make sure he don't get in the game at all. <clears throat> and then you could be like on the way home, man, yeah, coach be tripping, man. You know, he show favor to him. He show favor. You know, we going to get over it. Then you could talk that. But if you're going to blame the issue on the coach, you have to make sure that he does not get in the game. Hey, one other, one other thing. Stop. One other, one other way you can do it, man. And stop leaving his equipment at home <laughs> as an excuse, cause you know. Oh man, that nigga, that nigga forgot his cleat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if we, if we done drove all the way out to Rockville. <laughs> and you hear, oh man, little Ricky forgot his cleat. <laughs> That's because they knew he wasn't getting in that game. <laughs> and they don't think, hey, that nigga, man, you can't believe that nigga forgot his shoulder pads. <laughs> <laughs> and look, here's how it starts problems. Here's how the problems really start, how it leaks over and everything. Because, <laughs> hold up. <laughs> oh, here's how it starts. Here, here's how it kind of leaks over and messes up everybody's day. Because like, the grandfather be driving, man, he be like, you know, I ain't, I ain't you know, keep wasting my time. And, and a woman will always come in out of nowhere and say, let's well, like, <laughs> At least he's doing something. Or at least he's on the team. <laughs> don't, don't no man want to hear. <laughs> don't no man want to hear no shit like that. Men respect results. <laughs> we want results. <laughs> See, this is the thing with a man. <clears throat> if he's not that good, we, we just put him on a on a worse team. You know, we just want to see him get in the game. We just don't want. <laughs> Nobody. Who cares if your son is on the best team? <laughs> In the area, but he don't play. It, it, it kind of still the same thing, you know what I'm saying? Are you really proud of the trophy when you get the trophy? Do you put it on the ledge? <laughs> so we don't really care if the team wins. We want to see are uh, you. That's what a man will do. Hey, look, I'm putting him somewhere. Why you think all these people? And it, it doesn't stop. And you might think, um, um, oh, man, you crazy? Don't worry. No, and now because nowadays they call it reclassification. You just <laughs> if your kid ain't good enough. When he was in the 12, you know what I'm saying? Some kids, some kids out here, they reclassify and they can buy alcohol. That's not, that shouldn't be allowed. If your kid can buy alcohol, he shouldn't be playing high school basketball. <laughs> also, too, it don't even have to make a difference if he starts not if it's track. Unless it's a close friend or they special, stop inviting people to track me because y'all know how that works. You sit there and, and if you buy a cooler, uh, have have an umbrella, a tent, a cooler, and nothing to do the whole day if you're going to invite somebody to a track meet. Because track meets work like this. It could be 12 o'clock. Okay, Kenny about to run. Okay, yeah, yeah. Go, Kenny, Kenny. Ah! You know, Kenny did the 200 meter whatever relays. Then it's like this. Okay, yeah. Let me see. Let me see the schedule. Yeah, he he run again at four thirty. I think it's twelve forty five. What we what we what we supposed to do to four thirty? That just track me. Ninety eight degrees out there. To be. If you really love track, then then it's your thing. If if you're there to support somebody's kid and you just don't really know nothing about track, oh man, you got hell of a day in front of you. Hey, look, this, this, yeah, this one of them grandfathers that keep it, keep it real, Joe. Them old school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't gonna keep, I ain't gonna keep driving out this motherfucker. Nah, I'll tell you that now. I, you, somebody gonna say something. I, I ain't gonna keep driving out this motherfucker with nothing, man. This nigga ain't getting in the game. <laughs>